Laparoscopic surgery is a specialized way of performing surgery. It's also known as minimally invasive or keyhole surgery. In traditional or open surgery, the surgeon uses a single long incision to access your abdomen. In contrast, laparoscopic surgery uses several small incisions, each measuring a few millimeters, to insert special tubes known as ports. These ports are then used to insert instruments to perform the surgery. These instruments have long handles and allow the doctors to operate inside your abdomen while their hands are on the outside of your body. A special camera, known as a laparoscope, is used to see inside your body and to perform the surgery. The abdomen is inflated with carbon dioxide to provide space for the surgeons to work. Most intra-abdominal surgeries can be performed using a laparoscopic technique. Compared to traditional or open surgery, there are several advantages. Because the cut is much smaller, patients often experience less pain. And because of the smaller cut, when it heals, it's cosmetically better. They also have a shorter recovery and they return to their normal activities sooner. And because there is less handling of the organs inside your abdomen, there is less scarring inside as well. Laparoscopic surgery is often as safe as open surgery. At the beginning of the procedure, the surgeon will look inside your abdomen to decide if a laparoscopic procedure can be safely performed. If for any reason he feels that a laparoscopic procedure is not safe, he will decide to go ahead with an open procedure. This decision can be taken at any point during the surgery. Like any surgery, laparoscopic surgery also has potential complications. These include the risks of anesthesia, infection and bleeding. If your surgery included dividing and joining up bowel, there is a small risk of a leak from this joint. The length of hospital stay will depend on many factors. But patients who have laparoscopic surgery usually go home sooner than those who have open surgery. You would have had a few small incisions and these would have been closed using absorbable sutures. This means you don't need to come back to remove the stitches. You can have a wash without getting your dressings wet. Your doctor will advise you on your diet. You must get down from the bed and walk as early as you can. This will reduce complications, including developing a blood clot in your legs. If you develop pain while passing urine, redness or pain around the surgical sites, vomiting or worsening abdominal pain, you need to see your doctor immediately. If you would like to know more about this or have any questions, please leave a comment below. You can also comment on any topics you would like me to cover in the future. Thank you.